Bro sent the 500 likes. Bro sent the, sent the 500 likes. You guys remember when I was emailing these fools? Look at these fools, dude. These are the, this is the chick that was that was hating on me, dude. From this Now Foods. This is the chick that was hating on me, bro. Because I was asking her if she was correct. And she kept saying, I told you. I told you. And then I finally got a response back. They're admitting right here that even if they, they were wrong and lying, like at the very least, they're admitting right here, guys. Do we want that as a vitamin? Tell me in... Do I, Should we run a poll, dude? Who wants duck feathers in a vitamin? Just tell me how that... How the hell? When you ever ever would ask for that bro like we've got to just step out of the box for a second and be like all right this is this is what goes in human beings bodies right maybe not yours it don't go they don't go in mine right they don't go in mine but they're going in other people's bodies bro why why would we want to associate wherever in nature why won't why won't we make these on our own if they're so good why don't we make why don't we make these on their own? Right? Like it's it's crazy, bro. Like I have to get it off my chest, you know what I mean? And it's like it's not just duck feathers. It's they're cut with a chemical. It's they're they're made with they're hydrolyzed. That's a chemical. So it's like even if you wanted it all natural, you don't get the you don't get just the duck feathers. You get you get the chemicals too. Let's just see. Let's just see if you guys want to partake. If you guys want to partake. Oh, I already started. I already started a poll on it. All right. So why are you eating duck feathers? So if people want to order this vitamin called L-cysteine, it's called L-cysteine, okay? If you get it from Now Foods, Now Foods, Now Foods, if you get this, this vitamin from them, a lot of people do, man. Just a couple people that see my video, only a couple hundred people or whatever, they're saying, damn, bro, I just ate one of them. I don't know. Call me crazy, bro, but I would never, ever, 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 ever eat duck feathers that are burnt up with the chemical. I don't. I, I'm crazy. Hydrolyzed? Yeah, go look it up. It means that they use a chemical and water to break it down, and it's like crazy pressure, and it's it's not anything legit. Like they say it's they say it's hydrolyzed or it's purified. You guys look. I looked it up. You know what I mean? That's why I can recite this stuff in my live on the fly because I put in the footwork. And I'm telling you that this is this is not cool, you guys. When you see it for what it is, humans are eating this thinking it's their and it's not just this one, you guys. This is we know what what they're doing. We know what they're doing, right? Here we go, dude. This is the full expose, dude. This is the Aaron Brockovich, right? So we got citric acid. What's citric acid? It's it's not just citric acid. We got to go through three keywords. Pay attention. We got to go through citric acid, right? Then we got to learn that citric acid is also lemons, but 99% of it is Aspergillus niger. You guys are learning. You got the mold. Right? So what's Aspergillus niger? Oh, I had to put it here. I had to put a description right here because we don't know. Enough of us don't know what the fuck that is. Right? If we knew that they put this in all the foods, then what are we going to do? We're going to just keep shrugging our shoulders. Oh, okay. All right. Just head nod it. When you know this is in almost all foods, you guys. Come on now. This is, and then they make a, they're making vitamins and stuff out of it. Come on now. Come on now, they're growing this on fermented corn sugar. You, it's non-GMO'd, right? You think it's not, he didn't even mention if it was GMO. So you got GMO corn syrup. Is there a legit vitamin C? Yes, it's called getting it from food family. 
Look at your berries. Look at your fruits. Look at your veggies. Okay? That's where I get all my vitamins from my food, man. The only thing I supplement is my minerals. I take sea moss. And I take sour sop oil. That's it, man. Otherwise, vitamin D. Oh, oh my God. It's so... Uh, mushrooms. Just eat a bunch of mushrooms, bro. Well, how do you think people survive through the winter in the day? Back in the day? If they couldn't kill, make a kill... You have all these mushrooms around, dude. How do you get vitamin D when you're under the clouds? You get you eat mushrooms because they suck up the little bit of vitamin D that comes through. My sea moss I get from Dr. Truth in my bio. But you can you can find it other where other ways. Just make sure it's certified because they grow it in pools and shit. They grow it in pools and shit. So just watch it. Just you gotta you gotta dig in. That's why. When I make recommendations like sea, like the sea salt, I say Jacobson sea salt because I looked into that one. I've emailed them. I checked all their testing. As far as they're telling me, unless they really got me duped, they're the best salt that you can find. Best way to have the sea moss, Joe. You're welcome. I wish I could, but I'm too damn busy right now. The Matrix got me wrapped. I ain't gonna lie. The Matrix, too much l esteem going out there. And then, I ain't gonna lie. The Matrix, too much l esteem going out there. And then, and then, right, we went over the, we went over the, we're, we're cool with the citric acid, right? We're cool on that. We're like, yeah, all right. We know it's happening. And then the ones who ain't gonna eat it, they just ain't gonna eat it. You know what I mean? And then there's those that are going to be like, so what, bro? So what? So what? It's approved. Okay. All right, man. All right. So it's approved by who? Take a wild guess. Who approving it? I don't know. There's some people that approve dr drugs and alcohol, too. Those guys be approving lots of stuff. They be approving all of it. That other than nature... I don't know who they are, but that, that's what's going on. That's what's going on. Right? Cod liver oil, I don't vibe with it, fam. I don't vibe with it. You, you, you would never need it in nature. You would never be eating this cod liver or eating this cod. I mean, really, you would... And, and the, the mercury nowadays, you guys, we got to understand the mercury and the radiation that are in these animals... If you research it, I'm a, I'm a salmon fisherman, bro. I'm a, I'm a cod fisherman. I go to the ocean and catch fish too. And I quit eating these animals, bro. Like, I literally... Yeah, go ahead. I literally quit eating these animals. You see what I'm saying? Spring water. But what I'm saying is we when you read... This is why I don't touch certain things. It's what I tell people, man. If you learn it... If you learn it, if you if you learn that you're killing yourself, you can't keep doing it, man. That's why people hating on me all day. Oh, you're stupid, blah, blah. I'm like, go learn, go learn about it. If you, that's what I tell people, man. If you learn it, if you learn it, if you if you learn that you're killing yourself, you can't keep doing it, man. That's why people hating on me all day. Oh, you're stupid, blah, blah. I'm like, go learn, go learn about it. If you educated yourselves, you know what I mean? Like, or just be smart enough to use your discernment or be smart enough to lean on people who you think you could probably lean on more than others. People that you would think has your back more. Like, who you think these ones got your backs? I don't know, man. You tell me. Kaidozan, why are they feeding us shrimp shells? That's kind of crazy if you ask me. That's kind of crazy if you ask me. Eating, why don't we make these vitamins ourselves, fam? You know, you can make whole food vitamins at home. Like, if you take herbs and shit, you know you can make your own vitamins. Like, burdock root, ginger. You can make your own vitamins, right? Even with mushrooms, powdered mushrooms, right? You can make your own vitamins. Why wouldn't we be making these delicious? Why wouldn't we be fermenting our own citric acid, bro? We could save money on that citric acid and ferment our own. We just gotta grow black mold on GMO corn. That's easy, bro. Growing black mold on GMO corn? Pfft. Come on now, El Sistine. Let's get some duck feathers. Let's go down to the duck pond. Let's collect some duck feathers, guys. And then you get a bat of acid 
and you hydrolyze it with, with water and chemical, right? And then we melt it down. And, and if it's not the feathers, it's the human hair from China for El Sistine. That's what goes in the bread, right? All the, all the manufactured bread. It's, it's the, it's the, there's different variants. You can do the hair. You can do the duck feathers. You can do the, uh, the uh, hoofs and the, and the pig bristles. You can do either of those, fam, and you'd be and you'd be classified under the Elsistine. This is the what? What do I tell you about these words? What do I keep saying about these fucking word? These code words? They got them in between. You got to go. What's Elsistine? Well, it's the da, 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 da. then you got to go. What's da, 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 da? That's called rabbit holes, guys. These are real things, right? This is a this is a full blown evidential rabbit hole. No conspiracy theories involved here. This is saying. Blah 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 blah, and then here's the steam. Well, it's da da da. da. Then you gotta go. What's da, da da da? That's called rabbit holes, guys. These are real things, right? This is a this is a full blown evidential rabbit hole. No conspiracy theories involved here. This is saying blah 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 blah, and then here's the rabbit hole. Blah blah blah. Aspergillus niger. There's no more. There's nothing more to that. You know what I mean? But we got the blinders on to where we're just like feeling like everything's cool and normal. But then you look around and you're like, dude, nothing's cool and normal. So we're like, well, what, there's got to be some, some, something in the middle here. Something's got to give, right? Something's got to give. And then the homegirl's lying to me at first. And then the homegirl's yelling at me uh, saying, oh, you need to, I already told you. And then she's, and then I'm asking again. And then she takes a week, two weeks to reply. Then she finally comes back with a reply saying, I'm sorry. Uh, yeah, you're right. It's duck feathers. It's duck feathers. So I got two people admitting it now. I got two people admitting that they're using duck feathers in their vitamins. You see what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? Would we, would we, would we do this? Would we go out in nature, dude, and collect these duck feathers and melt them down and eat them and say that it's really going to serve you? Could you get away with eating it? Yes. But is that serving you as a vitamin? Literally, as a vitamin. Vital. Vitamin means vitality. Sorry, I gave you inaccurate information. You would think that this company would know what they're putting in their vitamins since they don't put it on anything on their stuff. If you go to look up on their site, go all over the place where they sell these products, they will never tell you this. You have to get a hold of them for them to tell you this. It's these things that all add up, you guys. I'm telling you. I'm trying to show you evidence of these type of things. You know what I'm saying? Like I'm saying like, yes, this may not be the end of the world, man, that they're using duck feathers, but it's the it's the nuance behind it. And I've caught it in how many companies? You guys saw my toothbrush video? Did you see the one I recently posted about the toothpicks? They're even lying about the toothpicks being plastic. Why? Why do they got to be so shady about it? Question. Good question. Good question. It's called El Sustine, bro. El Sustine. We're educating. You know what I'm saying? We're educating every day. We're trying to, to figure out what this stuff truly is. Because why? Because they hide it, dude. All I'm doing is reading between the lines. You know what I mean? I'm like, and then I got all the emails from the homegirl getting mad at me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I always talk to you guys in my lives. What's the product? Good question. Good question. Good question. It's called El Sustine, bro. El Sustine. We're educating. You know what I'm saying? We're educating every day. We're trying to, to figure out what this stuff truly is. Because why? Because they hide it, dude. All I'm doing is reading between the lines. You know what I mean? I'm like, they. I see one name and I'm like, all right, what's that name? Oh, it's this name. Oh, well, why the hell would that be that name? And then you look it up, and then it's like, oh, it's just duck feathers and human hair. And it's like, I, well, you wonder why they fucking using these code names. I, I would never guess. You know what I mean? Citric acid is really black mold. When they show you lemons all day, they show you lemons and the, the citric acid, bro. Like, come on, man. You know what I'm saying? What's up, guys? I see some of you guys dropping in here. I know they why they do it. I know why they do it. They hit the misinformation. That's like TikTok.